In Creo Parametric 4.0, when importing a Creo Elements Direct 3D model, you can use drawings associated with a Creo Elements Direct 3D model. After import, the drawing maintains full association with the 3D model. This shows the drawing in Creo Elements Direct modeling. The drawing consists of three sheets, multiple views and view types with annotations. Next I import this drawing with a 3D model into Creo Parametric 4.0. Different import use cases are supported. Beside the direct import of a bundle file to import a 3D model with the associative drawing in one step, also the drawing file can be selected and the corresponding 3D model in a second step. Let's select a bundle file. The Properties tab offers the ability to change the default color, mapping, text fonts and line fonts. All sheets and views are created with the corresponding scaling and visibility options. Annotations like dimensions or reference text notes are associative to the corresponding 3D references, which means all dimensions and notations are referencing elements of the 3D model. Let's now modify the 3D model by changing the position of one of these components of the assembly. In an additional step, I use direct modeling tools of the Flex Modeling extension and modify one of the shared components of the assembly. First I move some faces keeping tangency condition. Second, I change the radius of the cylindrical shape and change it to 45 units. Switching back to the drawing all sheets and views with annotations are automatically updated. All dimensions and annotations are measuring the right references of the 3D model. All model changes are reflected in the drawing. Leveraging Creo Elements Direct drawings when importing a Creo Elements Direct model into Creo Parametric saves time. No manual creation of a drawing is necessary.